I'm Kelsey Brennan Wessels, and you are watching Earth from Space on the European Space Agency Web TV. The Copernicus Sentinel 3A satellite brings us over the Bering Sea, north of the Alaska Peninsula, on March 26th. Seasonal sea ice dominates the upper part of the image. Ice plays an important role in the sea's ecosystem. Growing algae attached to the bottom of the ice. When the ice melts in the spring, it leaves behind a layer of nutrient-rich fresh water on which the algae thrive. Organisms higher up the food chain then eat the algae. In the top right corner, we can see part of Alaska's mainland, blanketed with snow, as well as the Nunavik Island appearing like a massive piece of floating ice. At the center of the image are the islands of St. Paul and St. George, part of the Pribilof Islands. An estimated 2 million seabirds nest on these islands annually. The swirling clouds on the right side of the image are the result of a meteorological phenomenon known as the von Karman Vortex Street. As wind-driven clouds pass over the Unimac Island on the right edge of the image, they flow around the high volcanoes to form the large spinning eddies that can clearly be seen. This image was captured by Sentinel-3's ocean and land color instrument, which helps monitor ocean ecosystems, supports crop management and agriculture, and provides estimates of atmospheric aerosol and clouds. And that wraps up this edition of Earth from Space. Remember that we broadcast online every Friday at 10 o'clock Central European Summer Time. Watch us on our website at www.esa.int. From the ESA Web TV Studios, have a great day.